Amazon Funko exclusives constantly get restocked. Let's talk about it. Are you looking for an awesome collector's group? Head over to Facebook now and join Gasocast. We Hunt Together. It's a great group full of great people hunting together. So head over to Facebook now and join today. There have been times where I see an Amazon exclusive Funko Pop sellout and I just flip out. I flip out because I feel like I'm never going to be able to get it and I'm going to have to switch to eBay or Macari in order to buy these Funko Pops. And that never happens. We learned recently that Amazon constantly restocks. And it makes me wonder how many of each of their exclusive Funko Pops do they make? Probably one million. Probably. Recently, Amazon put up all their Avengers exclusive for sale. Yes, for sale. For like $14.99. The only one that wasn't up was the Iron Man, and it makes you wonder why. I'm sure there's a stockpile of them somewhere. But I'm one of the morons who went out and bought all of them as they were coming out instead of waiting the long game to obtain them later on down the road. Amazon also restocked a bunch of their Star Wars Funko Pops. You know what else I saw on there recently was like some old con exclusives. That happens at a lot of stores. Yeah. Retailers every once in a while, you'll go to GameStop and it's like, oh, 2018 exclusive, whatever. It's like, what? Where'd that come from? I've grown a lot since I started collecting Funko Pops. I've realized that I don't need every single one, but Heather might tell you otherwise. But I've also learned not to freak out when something sells out because more than likely a restock will happen and Amazon is proving this point beautifully. And it's really frustrating because I would have saved $5 for each one of those Funko Pops that I purchased. How many are there? Minus Iron Man. Captain America, Hawkeye, Hulk, Black Widow, and Thor. That's $25. You could have bought three Funko Pops at Target. Yes, I know. See, I could have purchased more Funko Pops to fill up our house. It's already pretty full, though. Yeah, maybe you should keep overspending. Yeah, it's probably better that I do what I'm doing. Yeah. My favorite was the Millennium Falcon Amazon exclusive Funko Pop. You remember that thing? It's gargantuan. It's humongous. It mm -hmm. has Han Solo in it. It's a really, really cool piece. But I remember it dropped one day. And then like two weeks later, it was like $20 less. What? Yeah, and they do it all the time. Sometimes you'll see it for the $65 price tag. Sometimes you'll see it for like 35, 30 bucks. So keep your eyes out for stuff like that. Don't flip out if Amazon exclusives sell out. This goes for pretty much all the retailers for the most part, but Amazon specifically, I've noticed it with them that you'll see restocks all the time. In fact, you'll see restocks happen and you don't really expect to see like that pop ever again. And it's like, hey, I'm right here. But be careful because Amazon will also sell their Funko Pops by other sellers and it'll have a really boosted price. So make sure it's very clear that you're purchasing it from Amazon. And the way to do that is by going underneath the item. I think it's past add a cart and everything. There's a new and use selection. Yes. When you click that, it gives you all of the different sales of that item. Make sure that it says Amazon or Amazon Warehouse. That's where you want to purchase from. You buy from one of these outside sellers, most of the time you're buying from a flipper. Why'd you say it like that? When I think flipper, that's how I hear it in my head. Flipper. And we all know flippers are trash. Also, in case you're wondering, go on the Amazon app and type in Funko Amazon exclusive. You'll get their entire exclusive list. And sometimes you'll find something on there that you're looking for at a really, really good price. Like right now, there's Han Solo and Tauntaun for $14.87, it used to be $24.99, and that's pretty great. Wow, that's 40% off. Yes. Additionally, there's the Wampa figure for $14.87 when it was once $24.99, another 40% off. This is a really, really cool deal. And speaking of con exclusives, a WonderCon exclusive from 2020, Captain Adam is up, and he is $9.43, which is a 37% off he was originally $15. So that's pretty good. Wow, is that the Doctor Strange edition? You're going to get so beat up by the DC fans. I don't know anything about DC. He only wishes he could be as good as Doctor Strange. You're really going to get beat up for saying that. Good, come at me. Don't freak out when Amazon exclusives sell out on Amazon.com. Unless it is the Iron Man from the Avengers Assemble set. Then freak out. But you can't because that's in the past. Hey, listen, it could be any day now. It'll pop back up and people will be in a frenzy. It'll sell out and then it'll come back again and you have your Iron Man once again, not paying flipper prices. Mark my words, that thing will show up again at some point. What if it doesn't? If it doesn't, 
then remember all that stuff Heather was saying about DC? Let's remember that. <laughs> Guys, what are your thoughts on Amazon Funko exclusives? And have you ever been able to snag a really good deal after the fact on Amazon? Let us know all of that and more in the comments section down below. All right, guys, that time again. Remember, as always, we hunt together, yes. We'll catch you next time. Bye.